the ice in fourth place after the short program, Igor Pashkevich of Russia. The music, Andrew Lloyd Webber's Variations on a Theme of Paganini. Vyacheslav Zagorodnik for technical merit, 5.8s and 1.57, and for presentation, 5.8s and 5.9s, he is still in first place. And this combination, first a triple axle, very nicely done, double toe loop. Combination that he has planned triple lutz double toe loop very important uh, at least a complete triple lutz but the landing not secure enough to put in the double toe you know Igor Tashkevich though finishing 15th at the 94 Olympics showed some promise and then kind of disappeared last year spent four and a half months off the ice an infection and a virus that paralyzed half of his face. He missed the Russian nationals, the Europeans, and the world. But earlier this season, came back to finish second at the NHK competition, just behind the reigning world champion, Elvis Stoiko, and just ahead of one of the favorites here at the European Championships, Philippe Candeloro of France. There you have a look at the spider on the costume of Igor, reflecting the theme of this long program. And that makes these particular movements understandable, these arm movements. Ilya Kulik, who was also here in Sofia. And the Russian world team has yet to be named. We have no doubts that Alexei Hermanov, who won the gold at the 94 Olympics, will be one of those. But the second and final spot still up for grabs between Kulik and Peshkevich. Russia in fourth place heading to the free skate, trying to make the Russian world team. Back in so 